making bread, focaccia bread. Some would say the best and easiest bread. Some would also say not, but they would be wrong. First, we're gonna proof our yeast. Warm water, yeast, sugar, sprinkle of sugar or honey, and then we'll let it foam up and then we will go to the next step. So as you can see, our yeast is foaming up like a pro, because it is a can-do yeast. And I'm gonna add three cups of flour into this bowl. Start off. Three and a half cups. This is the and a half. That's as close to measuring as I'm gonna get. Then I'm mixing in this basil pesto because it's Italian. Focaccia bread is Italian. They'll go together. Plus I'm gonna add some olive oil anyway. So might as well start with this. Also gonna add in some salt and pepper. We'll add more on top later. Salt. Then some olive oil. How much, we will find out. I think it's supposed to be three tablespoons. Now, if you'll recall, we started with just about this much water. So this has foamed up a lot, which is great. That means the yeast is active and alive and happy and well. Everything that we're trying to be in 2019. So we're gonna pour this in here. That looks like a lot of yeast flour ratio. I'm probably gonna have to correct that with more flour. But that's the beauty of bread making. Super forgiving. It doesn't care what you do. Just keep adding moisture versus flour versus moisture versus flour until it gets where you want. That's all you gotta do. I think I'm gonna get my mitts into this. <laughs> Till I was tired. I'm not gonna say it's done completely, but we'll let it rise again. So I'm oiling up my bowl because we're gonna stick the dough in it. So we stick our dough in it and we flip it over so the top is all greased. Then I've been heating up water, stick in the oven to make it a like nice moist home and then I'm going to put the dough in here, cover it with the towel. Blazing. This is just like my facial yesterday. Then we're going to leave it in there for forever, like an hour, two hours. Okay, now we're forming the topping for the focaccia bread. First, our peppers and onions, olive oil, plenty of olive oil. Then we're going to salt, pepper, but we can just sprinkle those. And then I have all this rosemary that I'm gonna snip up into this mixture. Then I'm going to squeeze two, three, how many ever garlic cloves? Seems right. Fingerprints. This is what makes it focaccia bread. Then we're gonna sprinkle our stuff on it. the t- 
towel for some time. Oven is preheated to 425. The focaccia bread is maybe risen slightly more. We're gonna bake it like this. And as soon as the oven is ready, then partway through, we're gonna top it with Parmesan cheese, but not till it's been in there for a bit. Ten minutes in. Still not done, but it's time to add the cheese. Also, I put it on the top rack. 